let's check it out okay so we have been working on play lab for um for a few sessions in our uh, previous playlist right let's see uh, how this is going to be i'm just clicking on it to create a new project of this so play lab free reader let's check out what exactly it has to offer and what are the blocks what are these and how can we use them let's check it out okay so we have when run and we have some blocks here most probably we only can use these blocks in this one and not more so we have uh, show and we have some characters over here oh wow we have bunch of characters here maybe maybe i will just choose a ghost let's oh wow <laughs> like you can see here it is just setting the ghost picture show let's get another one maybe let's say wizard oh my god okay uh let's get another one penguin let's get another one octopus let's see how this uh, this will show them oh okay they are having some random positions oh okay uh, like can you see this so wherever they are they are getting those positions only okay uh then most probably cat should get this position and uh, dino should get this position let's check it out oh yeah cool uh let's just use these things and uh, let's set a background also let's explore what does this block do so it can uh, actually set up backgrounds right maybe i will choose this okay it's cool uh, like a uh, night background with stars on it yeah seems good for me for now then we have event blocks also so when when up arrow right arrow down arrow and left arrow is pressed then we can actually do something maybe when up arrow is pressed we can move the character upwards right so here we have up again we have other arrows also okay so let's also get this other one so when down arrow is pressed move uh, the character downwards okay so when right arrow key is pressed move this rightwards and when left arrow key is pressed move cat leftwards okay so we have four uh, things now let's check it out if that works or not. so cat is moving rightwards when i just press the right key downwards for down key leftwards upwards cool it is having some movement now so when this particular event occurs only then this particular thing will happen okay so that's how it works and then we have some uh, other events also which we can explore when when touching this thing right maybe i'll just choose this because when touching dino we can do something else right so we can set cat okay we can say something let's say uh, let's set cat saying something over here maybe we can type in some message over here saying hi dino hi dino how are you doing how are you doing okay let's reset and run so we have a cat here let's just move it rightwards so like you can see when touching dino it's doing nothing so it's 
so what does this block do right not really sure of this block here correct when touching cat who is touching cat that we am, we are not sure oh when clicked on cat i think right most probably oh wait reset and run yeah <laughs> okay that's not touching that's like clicking okay so when cat is clicked we could figure it out i'm using this for the first time and uh, <laughs> okay so this is like for small kids and uh, it's it's fun now it's getting fun hi dino uh, how are you doing it's just asking right cool uh, this is cool then we can do we can make a conversation around all these things right okay let's create a conversation then so when clicked on dino then it answers with another say block i think this thing so he will say hey cat hey cat we have other friends too we have other friends too let's let's talk to them okay so it's there i think i'll just decrease the size of it so that you can see it okay so let's talk to them okay let's just reset and run it now i'll click on it so it says hi dino how are you doing and then this oh wait we have to make dino say this thing right reset and so cat says hi dino how are you doing and dino says hey cat we have other friends too let's talk to them right now now let's make wizard say something when it is clicked so when you click on wizard then he will say something let's make wizard say hey people i am new here and my name is wizard okay so this says that right and then let's make our ghost say this let's get another say block let's make ghost say hi friends i'm a ghost <laughs> cool <laughs> okay i'm a ghost hi friends i'm a ghost don't be afraid of me <laughs> okay let's keep on it and say something hi dino how are you doing hey cat we have other friends too let's talk to them Hey people, I'm new here, and my name is Wizard. Hi friends, I'm a ghost. Don't be afraid of me. <laughs> cool. So this was a cool conversation between them. We can still make up a story, right? Um, we can give random movements for our sprites, maybe. Uh, let's check if I get anything related to that. No. so this is like if one touches each other is most like uh, when you see this kind of a symbol so i get to understand that let's say when cat touches wizard right so let's make cat say want to be friends okay cat say what do want to be friends let's check it out one so i'm just moving my cat now and i'm let's go i'm just going to touch wizard so it says want to be friends okay cool then let's make um, wizard say of course i'm looking for 
Of course. Of course, yes. I am looking for a friend. Okay, so let's reset and run it again. Uh, let's move our cat downwards. So he's touching wizard and it says, want to be friends? Of course, yes. I'm looking for a friend. Okay, cool. This is, uh, this is cool. And uh, now when our cat goes and touches ghost, Uh, okay, let's not say something here, but let's set cat's move to, uh, to sad. Okay. Yeah, let's set cat's mode to sad because it is seeing a ghost and it is like afraid and it is sad. Okay. And sets, no, we'll play some sound also. Let's play some loose point sound like that okay uh, let's see how this works first so let's move our cat downwards and rightwards oh see it is very sad now it also played that very sad sound right now our ghost will say something let's uh, let's just make it say something uh, let's make ghost say, hey, don't worry. Hey, don't worry. I'm not going to do anything. You can be friends with me. Okay, so let's. So uh, let's then make uh, cat mood happy after hearing to that. Then let's make it say something. Oh, wow, really? Oh, wow. I was, uh, I was afraid to see you. But it's so cool. After being friends with you. Let's reset and run again to check it. Now I'm just going quickly towards uh, ghost. Hey, don't worry. I'm not going to do anything. Oh, wow. I was afraid to see you, but it's... It's cool now. So he's so happy. <laughs> right. Well, we can also set ghost mode to happy after this, right? So set ghost mode also to happy. So let's move till here. Oh. Wow. So the both are happy, happy friends. <laughs> okay, so these are few events which we have. Apart from these three events, I don't really find any other event here. Okay, so these we can do, right? Now we have been doing like, uh, if I just reload the page, you'll get to see all of these things. So let's quickly get get through all the things which we've been doing so far so we have set up a background we have set up some characters and when up arrow is pressed it will move upwards down down arrow downwards right arrow rightwards left arrow leftwards so when cat is clicked then it says something when dino is clicked it says something when wizard is clicked it says something when ghost is clicked it says something right so when cat and wizard touch each other then they have some a small conversation kind of a thing when cat and the ghost touch each other they have small conversation right and then next thing let's say um we have explored the this thing we have explored this we've explored all the other blocks which we have on top 
mood thing okay set speed we haven't yet explored right so you can set uh, a fast speed a normal speed a slow speed and very fast speed okay so you can like uh, let's just make cat go faster let's say when when cat is clicked right it says something and it also like uh, starts moving faster in a cheetah speed let's say now i'm just okay it's speed is increased now yeah like it's moving quickly okay so it is getting the speed while moving it is getting the speed and then we have throw aeroplane oh airplane and uh, yellow hearts up so let me just put it over here read it and run uh so whenever it is clicked it is throwing hearts now yellow hearts upwards okay cool right we can create a small game with this we can make some uh, some sprite vanish also with this we can play some sound we have used this we can score some points we can wait some number of seconds we can repeat some event wow with all of these uh, we can actually create a small game too right so yeah we have explored these blocks right in the next session i will show you uh, by creating a small game let's explore these things and uh, let's let's see how that works right by creating a small game okay so in the next session i will show you how to create a game and how to make it interesting right so in this session we have just explored few blocks and yeah we got to know that we have we can do these things here right yeah bye bye guys thank you so much for watching this video and this is all for today please do like comment share and subscribe to my channel folks hub so yes thank you so much for watching this video i'll be meeting you all in the next